Hello everyone, this is Chris aka The Dark Wall, and I'm back! Yes, I still exist. I draw breath from this earth. Which you may not believe if you saw my last week of YouTube, which was nothing. Sorry about that, got myself a little bit edited out on the super amazing 500 subscriber special. But I'm back in the game, and we are starting to get back in the game with the last time. No, I'm not quitting YouTube. This is the name of the game. It's been out for a little while, it's a Game Jolt game, and it had a Kickstarter because it's going to have a super nifty full version. This is the demo I'm playing. So, let us see if it is worth our rhetorical kickstart money, because I am not giving them money, but I still wish to judge them as if I am. Let us begin. Once you have finished reading tutorial text or dialogue, click anywhere to move on. Okay. Okay, I gotta do my cop drama voice. <clears throat> Four arrows on patrol without a single crime. Don't you just love nights like this? When presented with multiple dialogue options, click the one to or click on one to select it. Thank you for this insightful thing. Let's see. Do I like the piece? Nah, nah, I'm a rebel. Lance Striker, always ready for action. Not really. I like to get my hands dirty. Otherwise, it feels like a wasted day. Well, that's what we get when our patch is a rural area. Nothing but farmers fucking pigs. Not that I don't like farmers fucking pigs. I watch it on the internet all night. Okay, I'm gonna move on. Not many opportunities to get your hands dirty out here. Super peaceful. It can't be a completely wasted day, though. We've got each other for company, right? <laughs> Are you coming on to me, Darren? Back off, son. Back off. Come on, Jack. Light it up. Entertain me. Okay, this is getting a little bit creepy here now. Options presented in capital letters with square brackets like this represent actions you can choose to take. Tell a joke, sing a song. Ooh, I don't know, I don't know. Ooh, which kind of joke should I tell? Let's tell, just do a joke. No, fuck that. We're gonna sing a song and it will be beautiful. How about a song? Oh god, this is getting a little bit erotic here. Perfect. Just unzip your shirt, or button your shirt. Unzip your pants, Wh whatever, guys. You guys are perverts. I, I can't believe this. Okay, here it goes. Oh yeah, here we go. We go kung fu fighting. Kung fu fighting. Da, 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 da. Oh, la 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 something something. What's wrong, man? You worried about copyright or something? I, I just forgot the lyrics. Shame, you've got a good singing voice. I'd love to hear you squeal for more. Maybe you chose the wrong career. Okay. Hey, you want to hit us today? Um. Fuck, I'm gonna I'm gonna be safe. It's not your birthday, is it? If it is, I swear I didn't forget. I just left your card at home by accident. Baka. Mate, don't worry about. Okay, he's he's British now. Mate, don't worry about it. My birthday's not until June. That's my British voice. Can't you tell it's British? I'm sure a game of slight would approve. <laughs> Fuck. It's been five years to the day since we joined the police. <laughs> Fuck. I'm gonna stop that now. Can you believe we've known each other five years? No. I just started playing this game, so fuck you, man. Don't don't presume that I know your relationship. I know, it's hard to believe, right? These years have flown by. That's not what I said. I said, fuck you, man. Who are you? And how did you get in my truck or car or whatever? Yeah, tell me about it. Do you remember how we met? Okay, this is getting really gay here. First he's like, oh man, you have such a hot voice. Entertain me. Relax with me. Do you remember how we first met? C c this is getting... He's making too many moves. I'm getting a little uncomfortable here. Uh, let's see. Oh, what kind of yaoi situation do we have? We met in the elevator. 
and passion erupted. How could I forget? I met you in the elevator back at the station. <laughs> yeah, and I and you knocked into me and spilled coffee all over my uniform. And I was all like, you're gonna have to get this clean somehow. Okay, I'm gonna move on. It was embarrassing. I was mortified. I think I apologized a thousand times. Ha! Huh, that's what I love about you, Jack. You take everything so seriously. God damn. <laughs> What's going on here? That's why we make such a good team. Okay, this motherfucker better not like try to touch my hand. Uh oh, uh oh. This is dispatch calling officers Glover and Price. Repeat, this is dispatch calling officers Glover and Price. Dispatch, this is Price. I'm sorry. Dispatch, this is Price. We got a report of a burglary in your area. Is the burglary still in progress? Negative. The homeowner called and said that their place had been broken into, but that it was empty by the time they got back. So we just needed to gather evidence. Affirmative. What's the address? 13 Evergreen Place. Got it, dispatch. We're on our way. Looks like you might be able to get your hands dirty after all. Mate. <laughs> Uh, clicking on interactive objects or character will present you with icons showing what interactions are available. Look, talk, or use. Click on the relevant icon to perform that action. You can talk to Darren for hints. Oh, should I knock on the door? Darren, what do I do? Yeah. What should we do? I'll try the doorbell. <laughs> it's crazy enough that it might just work. Okay. <laughs> Oh, I should have checked that shit. Maybe they could have clues on it. Who knows? Okay, look at these hats I've got. I like the, like, got the pointy little Scotland, or, what do you call it, British hats going on. Well, I guess they said mate, so this is probably made by somebody who's British. Looks like they're not coming. Okay, let's see if I can find some hints here. Nice doorbell. I've seen better. <laughs> you don't know about my family. We invented doorbells. You want doorbells? We got glass doorbells. We got platinum doorbells. We got fancy Muro doorbells. Okay, I'm gonna move on. Shall we go in? Let's do it. Okay. Anybody home? No, it's the police. They better know to respect. This is the police. Where do you think the owner is? Hiding? Left the house. If I got robbed and I knew the person was gone because they said in the call that they were gone, I would have left the house. But to be safe, I'm going to say hiding. Because I don't want to go in there with the presumption that they are not there and then like stumble upon them and have like some sort of freak out happen. Maybe they're hiding somewhere. They could be scared. Yeah, you might be right. What about the door? How do you think the burglar got in? He didn't force the entry. It didn't look like it was fucked up at all. Pick the lock. Or maybe he had a key. Dun, dun, dun. Maybe they picked the lock. I don't see any signs of forced entry. Good point. Right, I'm just going to dust the door for Prince. You mind checking around the house for owner? For the owner, sir. My British guy isn't exactly the best speaker. You'll have to forgive him. Yeah, I fucking mind, bitch. You've been doing nothing but presuming we had a relationship and hitting on me this whole trip and now you're giving me orders? I ain't your bitch. How do I, How about I check for Prince and you check the house? Oh god, he's gonna get killed. Okay, never mind. I think it's your turn to do some leg work. Did he just call me a fat bastard? I think he called me a fat bastard. I should kill his ass. Clicking anywhere on the floor will make you walk to that location. Walking to an open doorway will make you move to the next room. You can click, still click on objects and people to interact with them. Well, thank you. Sitting down won't help anyone. It will help my tired legs. Do it. Watch that shit. <laughs> you better leave the TV off. The boss may got, get mad if he sees you just sitting on your ass on the job. He's like, okay, where is the burglar? And he's like, I don't know, but this episode of General Hospital is really good. Alright, alright, alright. Let's check this hat stand. One code on the stand. Does the owner live alone? Maybe, maybe. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think I'll leave my coat on. It makes me look more official. That's it does. Oh, uh, anyone hiding in there, maybe? It's locked. Ooh, that makes me nervous. That makes me think dead person in closet. 
Oh god, what do I have a feeling I'm just gonna like slow suddenly get blown up or something? This just doesn't seem good. Oh god, this makes me nervous. Light switch, press that shit! Ah! Fuck! <laughs> I'm such a bitch! I am such a bitch that actually did startle me a little bit. <laughs> oh man, that's great. Holy f- Okay, hold on. What's his voice again? Oh, yeah. Holy fuck! Ooh, we got a gun. We got a gat. We got a gat. I better take this for forensic analysis. We'll need to send a coroner along with this guy, or for this guy. Huh, he did it to himself. Maybe. Or maybe it was made to look that way. Items you acquire can be used on certain objects or characters. Clicking on such an object or character will display that item as an icon, much like l much like look, talk, and use interactions. Okay. Blood spatros. Looks like the victim was shot from the f in front. Self-inflicted? Uh, I don't know if it was self-inflicted. I expect to see it on the wall to the left, not on the back. That's a really inconvenient angle to shoot yourself on. But then again, if you look at the point of entry on his head, it's sort of sideways, so I guess it could be. Maybe he was facing the window, but then if he was facing the window, why would he have fallen backwards onto the bed? Because if he was facing the window, he would have fallen backwards onto the floor. Because that would have been... Would have been very, okay, whatever. We're moving on. Okay, I'm gonna touch your body. Let's talk to him. Hey, you alive? Just checking. <laughs> oh, that's great. Single shot to the head. There are worse ways to go. Gun? I think he's had enough. <laughs> I'll tell you when he's had enough. Now shoot that dead man in the head. No way I'm gonna check for vital signs. I know a corpse when I see one. Touch the dead body for me, damn it. It will make me happy. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, my partner. My partner. Shit, somebody was hiding in the wardrobe. Fuck, I knew it! Don't come every- Okay, that was a bad voice. Hold on, we're gonna try again. <clears throat> Don't come any closer, copper! I'm sorry, Jock! Oh, goddamn, all my voices are blending together! I was trying to stop him from leaving. Shut up! Just shut up! No, this was supposed to happen. Uh, okay. Just calm down. No one needs to do anything stupid. I've already done something stupid, man. Uh, he's looking away. If I draw the gun now, I don't know... If, ooh, this is hard. I could be able to save my partner this way, but there's a risk. But if I keep talking to him, I might be able to talk him down, but he may kill him anyways. <sighs> Damn. Damn, damn. Let's see. He doesn't know I have the gun, so there's no point in dropping it. Um. She's pretty ag agitated. Somebody, he's not feeling like no one has to get hurt right now. I don't know. If I step forward, that's going to be pointless. That's going to fuck everything up. Uh, no, I don't want to jump to conclusions. I can't damn people before they've had a chance to damn themselves. No one has to get hurt. It's too late! It's too late! Uh, I'm gonna try to be good to you, man. Don't do it. Take it easy. I'm cool, man. I'm cool. Okay, it's going in the right direction. Come on. You don't have to do this. I never meant to do this. Everything will be okay. I don't know if I can ever be okay. Just relax. How can I relax after what happened? Take some deep breaths. I'm breathing. Okay, it's gonna be fine. I'm not fine, man. Think rationally. It's too late for that. God damn it, I'm just gonna sit here like this forever? Keep a clear head. I can't. Everything's so messed up. If I let this guy go, do you promise me you won't send me to prison? Ah! If I tell him yes, he's gonna think I'm lying. If I tell him no, he's gonna shoot him. So... Fuck. Oh, man, this is quite the hard choice. How far in this man's head do I go? He's not rational. He won't... Th Maybe there's a chance he'll believe me if I tell him I won't take him. Okay. Yes, I promise. Jack, you can't let me get what you dumb shit! Shut up! No, 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 
No, no, no. Fuck! Damn it. Damn it! Mr. Glover. Mr. Glover, damn it! Ah, there we are, Mr. Glover. We were having a nice little nap. No, I was getting my partner shot in the head. I should have shot the fucker. I knew it! Damn it! You woke me up. I told you I wanted to sleep forever. I was having a perfectly lo lovely nap until you interrupted me, Josephine. Where's your manager? I want you fired. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Glover. You poor thing. Let me make it up to you. Is there anything I can get you to make you more comfortable? <laughs> Why am I a pervert? Why am I a pervert? <laughs> oh, God. A hug. Yeah. Would you a hug me too much to ask for? I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Glover, but after what happened with Mr. Montgomery, all staff are surely forbidden from ugling residents. You know... You should really get out of your room more often. It won't be... It won't do you any good to stay cooped up in here all day. I'd best check on the other residents now. You have a good day, Mr. Glover. <sighs> I really wanted a hug. No, oh, fuck the phone. I ain't the phone's bitch. Whatever, phone... Fine, whatever. Whatever, I'll pick you up. Hello? Hello, is this Jack Glover? Who are you? I'm an associate of your old partner. What? How do you know Darren? It's difficult to explain. It's better if we meet in person. There's a park around the corner from you, your old folks' home. Meet me there in ten minutes. Can't you come here? Nah, fine. We'll do it. We'll do it. I'll be there. Looks like I'm gonna be breaking out of here. Oh yeah. Coming soon on last time. Oh, we got fires, we got disco dancing, we got bitch slapping. Hell yeah, back that shit on Kickstarter. Hell yeah, wait, I'm not gonna give you guys no money. Fuck that. You guys wanna give them money? Well, they've got like till Wednesday or the end of Wednesday, I think, of the Kickstarter. So if you wanna give them money, you can. I would give them money, but I am not a ch I'm not I am a cheap bastard, okay guys? Okay, are you happy? So I am not going to be shooting money their way, but if I had money to shoot, I would shoot it all over their bodies. So please proceed to do that if you can. Anyways, this has been last time. It was a cool-ass indie pixel story game, and you know I love those. If you have any more of those, shoot them my way, and I will pay them. I will play them. Gotta remember that L there. Anyways, I thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and show your friends. Show them all about my creepy gay partner murder love story. And also, believe it or not, you can click the cards at the top right of the screen and you will see more videos that I have done. Once again, I'll thank you for watching a second time. Only one thank you owed, but you get two because I love you guys. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.